didn't stop playing the piano. I played when I was a child, and then I played the clarinet, did other things. And when I was 24, I got the insane idea of relearning it. But I always figured that I needed something that interested me. So when I was a teenager, my parents took me to hear a concert. And I saw a man with a big black cape come on the stage with a trio, string trio, classical. I realized at the end of the concert, he only had one hand, and that was the famous Paul Wittgenstein. Ravel wrote a concerto for him, and that was a big influence on me. And basically, though, when I started playing the piano, I decided after a while that I wanted to develop the left hand, so it equaled the right. I mean, it's, it's sort of an insanity, probably. But I think I finally have, I'm very close to it. And I just want to tell you, because I'm going to do some left-hand solos alone. Now, that's a, that is a classical repertoire piece that composers write for. Whether they want to develop the left hand so it plays better with the right, I don't know. I mean, the left hand, in many ways, is a superior hand if you ever develop it. The point is that to develop it, you've got to be out of your mind. But the point is, I don't mean out of your mind, but, and you know, uh, there, there are in America several people who've lost the, the, the ability to play with their left hand, I mean the right hand, and so they took up the left hand. The thing is, so you will hear some solos I do for the left hand, you'll always hear also that the left hand plays an equal role pretty much like the right hand. I'm going to start now. Thank you very much.
on now. I'm going to play a thing called Poignant Dream.
remember one line in this piece, and you may get the feeling in the song. I've dreamed all my dreams. There are no more dreams to dream. That's as far as I got. <laughs> and actually, I think there's a poignant in the songs I write. I find uh, I've been told, I wouldn't say they're sad, but there's a certain quality that's on the borderline. Thank you. 
I got a, 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 a song that a lot of people seem to like. It's called When Autumn Comes.
Laura Bergman, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much. Once again, Borough Bergman. One more. Thank you. Wow.